What is going on, Cosmic Army? PTS42 here, and welcome back to Firewatch. So, in the last episode, we found the angsty teens' second camp out where they were sleeping and where they were camping out and all that stuff. They had a fire that led us straight to them, but it turns out someone already destroyed their campsite. And that leaves the mysterious question as to who did that and why, or what did that? It could have been some sort of deranged animal. It's the beginning of day three now, and I have it paused at the moment because Delilah and Henry are talking. So let's go ahead and listen to what they have to say. All right, what are we going to say? Uh, I have a thick beard. A pretty thick, thick beard. Thick as a bowl of oatmeal, you, you know what I'm saying? Mm. For a while, <laughs> yeah. All right, perfect. Yeah, I've got a beard, dude. I want to know about your eyes. My eyes? Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. Oh, you're drawing me. You're what? That's Is very odd that because okay? that's what our wife used uh, to do. Don't, don't answer. I'm going to do it regardless. Oh, all right, fine. Your eyes, tell me. Uh... Tired. They look tired, I think. Oh, yeah? Yeah, very you tired. You at a certain age and you just... You think you're a younger person who just looks tired all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Speak for yourself, mister. I know the I feeling. getting old. Well, some people might see distinguished. Okay, got it. Thank you, Henry. You're mm, welcome. What you need? Absolutely. Maybe we need to, like, fix our... Maybe we just need to make some repairs to our window, maybe? Board up. We need to find some wood. I don't think there's going to be any wood up here, so maybe we need to run down and grab some wood from the lower floor if there is some down there. I'm not too sure if there is, but I guess we can go ahead and run down. Uh, yeah, we got a wooden board. Let's go ahead and take that. And we will... Let's see, is there any other wooden boards around here? Yes. Might as well pick them up as we can. I think we got all of the boards we need, except for this one that I'm going to take right now. Let's run up back to uh, our tower and board up the broken window, as the objective is telling us to do. So let's go ahead and board this thing up and get everything nice and fixed. We got some nails and a hammer on us. It's looking good. Let's board up the window. Yeah, smack it. Just like that. One more. Should do it. Perfect. Looks good. I got that window all patched Yeah, up. we did. So, what should I do now? What's next? What's next? What do you think is next? I have no idea. Are we going to meet? Me Are we going to go on a tender date? Straight. What's next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. That's it? Oh, yeah. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll give it to you. Okay, I'm ready. Okay. I think I am ready to tackle <laughs> Just instantly, just bam, I'm ready, ready to go, man. Nothing can stop me now. I am glad to hear you've really thought this through. I have. Of course. Yes. We've issued you a comfy chair to sit in and everything. Really? You know, it's not really that comfy. It's wooden and there's no padding. I think I actually got a splinter in my thigh this morning. Dang. Aw. Well, regardless, take a seat. The forest depends on you. All right. I guess we're gonna take a seat. Day nine. Oh, so we just we just fast forward quite a bit from day three to nine. So six days in between what has happened previously with the teenagers. So I guess we're out eating a sandwich. Hello, a nice oh, meal. look at that. Yes. Uh, I might never I'll leave never because leave. that's how freaking beautiful well, this is. Holy uh, crap. I called with some bad news. Look at Two that. young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported missing. Oh, God. They've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in a week. That's not good. They were an aunt down in Cody. If they're the girls from last week, then... Yeah. You're probably the last person to have seen them. Oh, crap, dude. Uh... I'm happy to be questioned. You should tell whoever that I'm happy to be questioned. Look, it's not gonna be an issue. That is so weird. If, if they turn up dead, then maybe. Should I just not say anything and save us the trouble? Uh, it's worth mentioning, I, though. I think it's worth mentioning something. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll, I'll keep it vague. Yeah, I, I think really I think you should. The cops. Me neither. All right, Henry. Thanks. Enjoy the sunset. I will. Look at it. I will enjoy the sunset. 
day 15. So from day 9 to day 15. So things are going very quickly. All right. What else is going to happen? Henry. So something weird is Henry, going on with these teenagers. Hopefully they don't turn up dead. They said they were leaving. So why wouldn't they have left? Obviously if someone kidnapped them or something. Radio. All right, I'm coming. Pick up the radio. What do you want? What's up? Hey, you big dumb idiot. Excuse me. Are you drunk? You're the big dumb idiot. Idiot. Dumb idiot. <laughs> oh, baby, you sound tired. Oh wait. Mm, I am. That's Julia. That's not Are Delilah. I'm fine, are you? Are How you are you doing? Why are we... Good this there. must be some sort of dream, or we're, like, hallucinating or something. What? Oh, sorry, Henry. Yeah, I'm good. Well, that's good. What the heck? Well, I'll let you get back to sleep then. <clears throat> okay, Jules. Delilah seems nice. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Sure. Bye, baby. How would how would she talk to us though? Day thirty three, so even more time is passing. Oh god! So we've been out here for quite a while now, a little over a month. Two forks, hike north and retrieve supplies. Okay. Supplies all the way up to our towers. Well, so we need to go to the supply drop, and good thing we've already well, been there before, so we know exactly where we need to go. Hiking in 90 degree heat, and I get to do crosswords. Isn't life miserably unfair? Yep. Anyway, very unfair. Remember, it's not just for you, okay? Other lookouts, biologists, a few people get their food there, and I don't want to have to call in for more. That's a good she point. Loads of good stuff, though. Beans. Ooh. Prunes, Ooh. Jerky. Give me with them prunes, you know baby. Six mm. prunes a day. Six. She's like really precise about That's it. That's a lot. She'd be great at this job if she didn't need wheelbarrows full of marijuana to function. Ooh. Feels bad. That isn't, don't prunes make you, like, poop a lot? Don't they, aren't they, like, high in fiber so, or something? Like, Pretty sure they, they make ago, you poop, you like, a crap ton. You were sleeping, I guess, and all I heard was the name Jules through the mumbles. Oh, so we were actually just sweet. talking to Delilah and not Jules. Oh, the note's still flying there from the last episode. What the heck? Oh, that's funny. Okay. You know, when it comes to her. Um, I shouldn't be here. I really shouldn't. Yes, you should. No, I just ran away from my problems. No, you didn't. Am I going the wrong way? Fuck up. Oh, look. So a couple of months before I took this job, I. I was with this guy. Oh. Javier. Oh, baby. Incredible, caring, sexy as hell. Yeah, we need to He was a driller down in Casper. We dated for almost five years. I was working with the Wyoming Outdoor Leadership School, and I was obsessed with it. I wanted to be an instructor so badly. Yeah? And I was sure I was going to marry Javier as soon as I could be bothered. Waltz was also a good excuse to... Get out of town, drink whiskey in the mountains, cut loose. Yeah, I could see that. I could see that. Then, um, Delilah, what are you trying to tell me? Got killed working in Gillette. Oh. Some reason. I didn't come home. Or oh, hey. Javier said it was fine. He'd go to the funeral, take care of his mom, stuff like that. It'd be easier solo. I guess. He came back, he left me. I came wow. out here. I lied and told my sister he fucked our neighbor. Dang. So, I lied to you. I came out here with a broken heart just like you. Ooh, so I guess we have more in common than you've told me so much we figured. About you, so, you know, there's something about me. We both fucked up. Dang. Dang. Supply drop is this way. Alright, we're heading to the supply drop. Here it is. Hopefully there's something in here now. Uh, food for other lookouts. Food for two... Two forks. That's us, I believe. Let's go ahead and take ours. And uh, end the day. Report heading home. Okay. Report right. getting supplies. Got everything I need out of here. Time to chow down. Time to chow Just down. Yours, right? Who do you think I am? Seriously. Day 64. Things are... <laughs> 
Seriously, progressing so quickly. Okay. Whoa, that does not look good. Proceed for what might be the biggest fire of the year. Yeah, it's really going. That doesn't look too good. They'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression, but I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer. Seriously. And she doesn't have a name yet. I usually think of something funny or something practical or hmm. a little risque. Which okay, so we need to come up with a name. But why don't you do the honors? How about the Flapjack Fire? Uh, Let's go with Flapjack fire. fire. Can you sell that as a name? You really like that, huh? I love it. Yeah, I said I did. It's I funny. love it. It's fantastic. Hey, flapjack Fire it is. Heck yeah. You probably asked me if it was a camp cooking accident or something. So there's this creek down the hill. Who? Um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? What is your favorite thing to do? What's that? I love to take a bottle of whatever I have on hand, plunge it deep into the water, and let it chill in there all day. Ooh. Interesting. And then, on nights like tonight, when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I guess that's I practical. My sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. That's a big margarita. I've got a huge head, dude. Uh... I would if I was with you. Bam! Got him! What's she gonna say to that? Sure, I would like it a lot. Are you looking at the fire? Uh, no, I'm not. I was. You should. Let me know when you are. I was looking at it. Okay, I'm looking at it again. I love how they look at night. They look During really the cool. I mean, it's beautiful, but it's, I'm kind of scared about it, though. Down, you can just get lost. I guess, yeah. 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 A little lost, man. Is that it? Glad you're here. I'm glad you're here. Me too. Me too. Good. Me too. I'm I'm happy, to Delilah. As much as I talk to you. Not in the same way. Are I there know, even any? I guess there are other lookouts, but we haven't we've talked to any of them at all. With someone the way we have. <laughs> I don't mean to get all heavy, but it's been really nice. Yeah. I wish I was over there. Yeah, are we gonna get into that weird thing? I, wish you were too. I think we I think we are. We could sit outside. We could talk. We got these radios. Yeah, like literally all we do is talk on the radio. You know. What could we do? Oh god, are we gonna get into this this dirty radio talk? Let me tell you. Oh, and it changes! Oh, uh, day seventy-six. Over two months? Almost three, Are you going even. Without a license? It's one fish, and I'm sick of all the stuff I got to eat. I guess that's true. No, I won't tell anyone you're a poacher. Oh, sick that burns. Me. I keep hearing reports from Fish and Game about a problem bear they're trying to keep tabs on. Can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find? There was a crew burning fire lines out to the east. Okay, um, so I guess we need to go you know, fishing, search the lakeside for bear tracks. Wildlife. So to the lake we go. Uh, bear problem? Uh, yeah, sure thing. Uh, let's, sure. No problem. let's go ahead and Remember say, yeah, we'll problem. go ahead and take care of it because it's our job. You are such a drama queen. Yeah, I am. Ugh. I'm a Victoria's <laughs> Secret model, baby. What do you expect? Bear shit. It comes with the title. You, you gotta Henry. be a drama queen, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is a clipboard. Someone left their clipboard out here. Huh. Well, it could have been one of the fish and game folks. See if there's a name or a credential or something. I can call Let's it take in. a look at this clipboard. Inspect clipboard. What the... Uh, it's... Holy shit. What is this? What's going on? You didn't actually find a bear, did you? Someone has written down what we said to each other. Have been saying. What? That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No That's weird. Way. Wait, hold on. Something's out here. Locate strange noise Henry. towards the canyon. Alright, let's drop... Screw the fishing pole. We don't need the fishing pole. There's you a strange noise. Any, any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, but also, you know, devastating. Towards the canyon, so we need to go up to this right side. Regardless, just let me know, okay, Buckaroo? Oh god, is this it? Oh, There's god. a radio! I I just called you that. Oh crap! <laughs> oh! Oh! Henry? 
What is going on, dude? We just got beat down. I just I got hit in the head, punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. You think I know? I just got punched in the <sighs> face. You found a clipboard with what? Transcripts of our conversations? Yeah. What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone, along with the radio of theirs. You know, somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. Wow. What in the world is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I I I I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station. Wapiti right Station. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Uh, I have no Wapiti idea. Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. It's north of the lake. It, it north of like the lake. Wapiti Station. All right, so let's sure make our way to lake. Wapiti oh, Station. So we need to go a little northwest, up a are little you? ways up here, and we, we should. Figure out where we need to go from there, I guess, to Wapiti Station. Here we go. There are people listening. No, there's no way, dude. to our conversations. The person or these people were hiding in the bushes down here. What the fuck, D? I don't know, Henry. This I need to go back this way. Crazy. Yeah, and you're not the one who just saw our words on a clipboard out in in the middle of nowhere. That's true. Those That's were freaky. Weeks ago. Extremely no, freaky. So what's to say that they don't have transcripts from three, four, or five weeks ago? Our entire relationship, friendship, our, our whole summer. That's so messed up, dude. That is Someone so messed up. We got supply cash over here. Notes and talking to God knows who. I might as well just go interact with it real quick. Uh, I guess we should get to the oh bottom God, of it. Get some answers. Great. Just keep a clear head. Don't, you know, do anything crazy. Like taking a job in the middle of nowhere with literally no escape from whatever. Yeah, whatever seriously. Is out there. Well, Freaky stuff. I meant, like, kill anybody. You got it, boss. Unless my life is in danger. That won't happen, okay? We got a note. I guess we can take a look at this. Ron got some bad news back home, so hopefully they'll let me out of here for a while. Who's to say through budgets being what they are? Did you get my note about what went down in Wapiti? Okay, Sheriff isn't too pleased with me, but I don't know. I probably overdid it. I wish you would have been there. I guess you must have gotten hung up, Dave. P.S. Amigo is Spanish and Professionals is Italian. We're on the right track. I, b I believe we're on the right track. We're going to head this way. Oh, there's a fence. Whoa, Let's report Delilah, the fence. There's a big chain link fence between me and the meadow. I, I don't think I can get past it. Yeah. Uh, a fence? Yeah, a fence. Yeah. How big? Big. It goes off in both directions. Acres. But what the fuck is going on out here? I don't know, Whatever dude. Is, someone doesn't want anyone to know about it. Sometimes biologists will cordon off a little area to study flora or whatever, but that's only a piece where we enjoy. That's... <laughs> well, see what you can do to get past it. All right. Yeah, I've tried to get in here before. No dice. No dice. Oh, shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. That's true. Look, I'm not going to be able to get into this place. Oh, shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here. Oh, I just said notices. that. God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. True. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Yeah? Where are they? Yeah, where are they at? There's a scout camp. Ruby they River. They a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. Perfect. They left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Scout camp. Oh, God, that's on the complete other side. Of this area. Oh man, and there's not too many trails we can take to Ruby River. I guess we have to go back to our tower. Southeast we go. We're gonna head back to our tower and hopefully find our way to Ruby River. Hey, I oh, called around. Delilah's saying something. With everyone else. Um Are the lookouts telling well, the truth? Are the other lookouts telling the truth? That's of pretty course. important. Why wouldn't they be? I don't know. Maybe someone told them not to. True. You're suggesting that you and I are actually being watched by whom exactly? That's a good point, though. 
Maybe the government? I don't know. I don't know, obviously. Very Someone true. Was telling folks I've worked with this is freaky. To, to lie? Big Brother is not casting a shadow on the Shoshone, Henry. Look, you should have seen this clipboard, Delilah. Yeah, I guess I should have. You seriously should have. I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Okay. Keep your radio close to you. Well, we're in the cave. Maybe the cave door is open now. Maybe we can actually investigate down here. Nope, it is still locked. Yep, still locked. <laughs> just give it a nice smack, just a little bit. I know we don't know what's oh, going on Delilah, yet, hello. You're saying I something. I have a good feeling. About I what? I like feeling vulnerable. It's not like you can just call the police. Yeah? I was thinking about the good ones. The good ones. It just struck me that if anything weird like this happened to them, happened to Brian. That's true. Uh, his dad could protect him. Maybe he'd actually enjoy it. He had his dad to protect him. That's true. He that, did. That, he did have his dad. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. It, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. Yeah. He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Hey, Delilah, what are you talking about? He's, he's doing fine, I'm sure. Let's climb these rocks. We're just about there to the tower, so that's good. Climb these rocks and, um... I guess make our way to Ruby River. I think that's what we need to do next. Right? I think so. Hopefully we're right. Alright, I can see my tower in the distance. I swear, if someone broke into my tower again. The flapjack fire. Let's oh, report the flapjack, the flapjack fire. fire. Going anywhere, huh? No, that's why those guys came out to burn that line. Hmm. It's at the stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. They're not going to try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. <laughs> All right, as I, look, as I gaze into the toilet. All right, let's make our way. I think we need to go look for the control burn south of Ruby River, which is there, and we need to go down southeast is where we need to go. Perfect. So I believe if we just follow this trail, we should be in good hands. But I think this is a pretty good place to end this episode we a lot of time has passed in game guys a lot of things have happened and there are some mysteries that we we need to unfold in this game and i hope you guys are excited for the future of this game because i'm loving it so far but i'm gonna go ahead and end this one here you guys thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it and want to see more firewatch be sure to leave a like down below and hey if you're new to the channel why not subscribe you can get more awesome content just like this. And do not forget to ring that bell to be notified when I upload a video. With that said, you guys, that's going to be it for me today. Once again, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, Cosmic Army, I will see you in the next video. So until then, keep on being stellar.